Welcome to Sean's Cooking Show, aka Soya DW's channel. Hello? Can you ring up my items, please? Yeah. Where's my stuff at? I like to buy this, please. Can you scan my stuff? Okay, that's not where it goes. I like to speak to your manager. Yeah. Uh, you're the manager? You leaving? You quit? No go. Nobody wants to work anymore. There it is. Presentation ain't all that great, but it was delicious. I promise you. Leave a comment if you want to poll. <laughs> Can you say banana peel? Peel. 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 It's not good like that. So you don't taste good. <laughs> A book? Yeah. A sleep. Yeah, he's sleeping. Can you do which one is which one is this? Heap. Okay, that's that one. What's this? Hat. A what? Horse. What about this one? Ow. You're just a cow. Oh, he's not even saying the words. Okay. What about that? Moon. Huh? Goat. Goat. Good job. What about that? Pig. Pig. And that one? You know that one. Duck. Why are you saying everything like, ah? Good morning. Day seven. She's back. She's back in business. Tummy came back online. Late last night, had some late dinner, woke up this morning, totally fine. You can't see it, but Cash is back there. The light just went off. We're headed to daycare drop-off, and I've decided to go to the Home Depot and see what they can do about my paint color. I'm going to return it if I can and just yeah. go. Yes, we're going to listen to EO and get and just go to Benjamin Moore, which is where the color is really for, from. I was having them color match a Benjamin Moore color. I told them the name of the number. I think that the man just lied to me and <laughs> told me that he had it and he didn't really have it. So I think I'm just going to go to Benjamin Moore if they will let me return that paint. Okay, there was one lady in her minivan that was eyeing me when I was talking outside. <laughs> Even when they do be wrong in the case of that paint color not quite being right, they fix it because the girl let me return it with no problem. Uh, she was also really nice. We had a cute little chat. Good morning. Bye, bye, bye. So, I think I'm now just going to go to uh, Benjamin Moore. But I feel like I should just call them and order it. Because sometimes in the Benjamin Moore store here, they get a little chatty. And I just want to pick up my paint and go. <laughs> Sean is so tired. And tell them what you just told me, Sean. I'm not a most successful people. <laughs> he said, I'm never waking up at 6 a.m. ever again. And then said, I'm just not a most successful people. Not, nah, man. Everybody be like, successful people start their morning at 4 a.m. And they be like, oh, they need that time in the morning. And I get it. I do. I don't think I need that time. <laughs> you was real proud of yourself. I was mad productive and then it came and bit me in the ass. You drew a, uh, remember this from yesterday? You had a shopping list and everything. I know, it's the only time where I could just do stuff that I need to do. You can do stuff. But now. After we put cash to bed, when I do I'm stuff. I'm too tired. I'm too tired. I can't even think of that time. That's because you done tried to wake yourself up at 6 a.m. Inadvertently waking me up at 6 a.m. And I do not want to be up at 6 a.m. You don't want to be. So I wanted to tell y'all <laughs> about my trip to the local hardware store because it was so nice and i know i'm always talking about the home depot but maybe i've changed my mind maybe i've changed my mind and small independent hardware stores are where it's at because i just had the most lovely experience what she suggested to me i okay on this project i'm using benjamin moore colors but I went to Home Depot to get them color matched. I told y'all yesterday how my red was so off. They nicely let me return the red. So I went to a Benjamin Moore outlet, which they're franchises. So they're always going to be kind of mom and poppy. And she suggested a sample, a tinted, a sample of my color to use as a lace, a bay. Oh my God. <laughs> 
to use as a another layer of primer and then because i'm using a semi-gloss i only need a smaller you know that'll make this stretch further this ain't yours it ain't mine no <laughs> Neither is this one. Yo, I was expecting gap packages. Neither of these are yours. Can, you can you go put them back? <laughs> I'm planning a video about other ways to find interior uh, inspiration other than Pinterest, although Pinterest is a great solution, um, which will be coming soon. And one thing that I did just discover, you guys are getting a sneak peek, is these um, like color booklets in the paint store. Like, look at this. You know, maybe you're doing a bathroom. Maybe you're wondering if something tonal would work in your home. Maybe you are looking for a specific style of chair, like with the cow skin rug. You know, I just feel like there's inspiration to be had here. Um, oh, I love the on this last page, that green and yellow with that wall, with the, with the wood of that. With the bedding there the bedding's really nice styles of sofa styles of lighting the mirrors the style of artwork the different types of flowers like even in this blue <clears throat> like right there they've got like a little indigo um, mud cloth like we have for sale in our shop thrown over the thrown over the side of the couch so just there are other ways more practical not more practical but just other ways to find interior inspiration so in that video when it does come out these will be included because I found these very cool. Right, so we're not still talking about the potty. We're not planning to pressure cash to use a potty. You're not. She's not. I am. No, you're not. It's not. Pee in the potty. <laughs> No, we're not going to pressure him to use the potty. However, in his classroom, there are children who are potty training. And when we spoke to his teacher yesterday, we had a parent-teacher conference yesterday. And she basically confirmed what we kind of already knew is that he is interested in pottying. Like, he tells us sometimes it's before, but more and more it's before he poops. It started off being after he had pooped, he would say, pooped. Now he'll say it before he poops, like, hey, I got to poop. So we figured we'd get the potty. So you have just... Have y'all ever had oh. this? <laughs> <laughs> so it's delicious. I want to show y'all something. So yeah, look at what's dip. on our fork, okay? And then look at the time. It was 10.45. It ain't p.m. And I just said to Sean... Just because society says that you should start your day with coffee don't mean that, like, coffee is the best way to start your day. Oh, and we don't, we're not making I'm drinking coffee. Co first of all, I've been up for a while now. And I'm just now drinking coffee. So, that's why you ain't trying to be the most successful people. I'm Eat sorry. buffalo chicken <laughs> for breakfast. Plain, too. It's not even, food. like. That's why I'm taking small bites. Well, not small. That's an average bite. So you don't drink no coffee. She don't drink no tea. I don't like coffee. She ain't got. I don't like hot beverages. She ain't, she. That's why you got to drink some tea. So I don't that, like hot beverages. At least with lemon, so you can um, mm -mm. you know what I'm saying it's good for your body. Remember that TikTok? No. About how a TikTok? You showed me a TikTok. I don't care about how influencer was like when influencers told you. Oh, uh, to drink water <laughs> to and start to wake your up. day with lemon water and making your <laughs> bed with stave off depression. I know what I need. I need I'm talking food. about, I'm talking about like. I need food. Okay. Oh, maybe I should. Oh, we are recording. Great. All right, so last night, I uh, sanded it, primed it, put on a second coat. Um, and this morning, Slee was like, it's not good enough. So. I definitely did. We had to prime and sand it again. Oh my God, what should I say? I was looking at the edge. So you're back to eating a buffalo chicken dip. Literally not more than an hour 
from eating it last time. She ain't even got no cracker. The cracker is in there. There are no crackers in yeah, there. Yeah, there are. Look in the snack drawer. She keep folding up this one <laughs> edge, thinking that just because she folded up, it's going to be a, a diet. That's like drinking. That's like drinking a, a diet coke. The reason I found this was with some ribs. It was on a college nutritionist. I love her stuff. I placed a gap order for no one but me. I didn't get Sean anything. I didn't get Cash anything. Thanks. I felt very good about it. And then she thought it was <laughs> delivered. And then on the checkout, it was a Black Friday. It was during Cyber Week end. They were like, oh, if you do this long A delivery, you'll be entered for a chance to win, not $500, but 500 points. And I was like, why not? Did you win 500 points? I don't know. It'd be great if I did. So what's the point of this story? That I placed that order on Cyber Weekend and the estimated delivery date was Monday the 19th. And I was like, well, that's... That's so far in the future. 500 points to spend on <laughs> more gap stuff. More gap stuff. I love the gap. He's touching his head, shoulders, knees, and toes. We have this app. You can't really see it on here, but we have this app that tells us everything Cash is doing at daycare. And um, we got pictures from the staff. It's so cute. And he always looking ridiculous in the pictures. <laughs> oh, there's a video today because they're making snow. Oh, we can't cover up all the kids' faces in the video. Oh, okay. But anyway, um, they, they be doing stuff. They had Joe's for lunch. Sometimes the lunch be like... What you eating together? <laughs> uh, also, we had a parent-teacher conference yesterday. Oh, yeah. Cash is gifted, basically. But we knew that. But we already knew that. He likes to hang out with the older kids and do what they do. So, he's doing pretty well. Yeah, he's doing great. We're very happy um, with Cash and his daycare. But we're also thinking about putting him in a Montessori daycare, so 